Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Behemoth and the Thick Immortals. We're playing more Jurassic Park and there's a corpse in the corner. No one saw that when we came into the room. It took us about mm, 10, nah, 5, 10 minutes to find this damn thing. This guy's dressed a lot like you, Billy. Does he have a tattoo on his arm? Like mine? Yes, yes he does. Laura. What's in here? Eggs. It is a nest. I thought the structure looked like the nest of a cassowary, maybe an emu, but without eggs, I couldn't be sure. Yes, but but they're inside him. If you'd asked me five minutes ago, I'd have told you such behavior didn't exist outside of class and secta, but Laura, now he's a human being. I I'm sorry. You're absolutely right. What the hell's going on over there? Is he alive or not? He's alive, but in a comatose state. Something has laid eggs in his abdomen. Something what? <laughs> I would, in all honesty, I would make the same the exact face. Being kept alive by a... I'm sorry? The victim is Daniel Kafaro, another throwaway grunt. Oh my god. I knew they'd gotten out somehow, but I never thought... Knew about this? You knew? Ugh. I'll kill you! Don't kill her. You gotta calm down. Calm down, Billy. You gotta chill the fuck out. Oh, look at that. <laughs> we started at the most, like... This is, like, the worst place to start. We should have just, like, added that 14... It's like a minute and a half, two minutes, some shit like that. Hey, Nick Herman directed this one. Tell us, Doctor, what's out there? What did this to him? A designer, Jonathan Straw. Trodon, Pectinodon. They were meant to be euthanized, but what? you let them out? No. Dave no. Bogan. Oh, friendly army. For study. I thought they may have been leaving the pen somehow, but I wasn't certain. And the programmer, Kim Patterson. While we were out there, exposed, humping around like idiots looking for our pile. Billy, wait. We were nearly Kevin, Kevin and Dan, the executive producers. Was bitten by one of those things just like decaf. Who knows where his catatonic body is now? Both our teams are dead. Oscar is dead. All because of your dinosaurs, all because of you. Uh... Those things. Listen, I get it. You're angry, but we need Laura alive. She's the only one here familiar with what we're dealing with. And what good does it do us if she keeps that intel to herself? Anyway, this witch is a liar. She's lied to all of us. Put me in the direct line of danger to protect her agenda and her precious freak show. What else is she hiding? Please, if I knew sooner. Oh, shut it. Uh oh. Put you in danger. Is that what this is all about? She put you in danger? You're acting out of vendetta here? Oh, don't turn this around on me. I'm doing this for Decaf and Vargas. Vargas! What is all oh. this? She's a liar. How can you deny that? Yes, she lied to all of us, but she also helped when she could. Nima is alive because of her. She could have warned us. I wasn't entirely sure yet. For all I knew, she could have gotten into the quarantine pens. Oh, so what? I'm the enemy? I'm the bad guy here? I'm just trying to open your eyes. I'm trying to show you the truth and bring someone to account for it. Um. You don't want to be the bad guy here, but that's where you're heading. You don't want to go down that road, right? Oh, come on. This isn't on me. It's time for her to take responsibility. Need my help? Oh, accountability. Is the enemy here? They spoiled the island. They made these monsters. You can't make her pay for all that Injun has done. Maybe. Put down the knife. We need to work together, all of us. All she has to say is it's my fault. It's my fault. Come on, Doc. Let me hear it. No, it wasn't. Say it! It's... It's m my fault. There. That wasn't so difficult, was it? Friends may have saved you here, 
At least I got the truth out of you. You want her alive? You got it. At least I got the truth. You sort of tortured it out of her. You just mark my words. She will save just one of those animals before she lifts a finger to help you. Now, everyone make themselves useful. I've got to tend to decaf. Look, we can't stay here long. Let's just give Billy a minute and see if we can find anything useful. A way out, even. Okay. We'll do a sweep of the room and check in when we're done. Agreed? Okay. Oh, sorry. My goodness. Let's see here. Fire extinguisher. I think they're empty. They're still heavy, though. Huele excremento. Oh, it smells like shit. Yeah, it does. Don't want to go outside. That's where the rafters are. Not much she can do. Locked. I don't want to get stuck in a vent with a dinosaur. Besides, there's blood everywhere. Ow! Hot! It's a boiler, Jerry. You're gonna burn your freaking fingers off. It's in here. A flare kit. This might come in handy. Don't talk to Yoda. He'll 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 blow up on you. What's in the vent? We got this great. It looks big enough for everyone. And it looks like it's heading in the right direction. Just great. It's locked. Anyone happen to have a key? I have a key for a random grate. Man, I'm really glad I got that. Let's have Nima grab that. Jess, stay close to me, okay? I'll keep you safe. Dad? It's okay. That's a good idea, hon. Yeah, she's Costa Rican Laura Croft. Guess we gotta talk to Billy. Are you okay? Jess, hon, leave him alone. Ew. Billy, we should cover decaf. I don't want Jess to see this. Yeah. Um. These Trodon, what else can you tell me about them? Well, they're nocturnal. They're intelligent, like raptors, but they don't hunt like them. They envenomate with a single bite, then back off. Stalk their prey. Their teeth are serrated and retain saliva, and the saliva is saturated with a toxin. Nima's bite. It was from a Trodon? Yes. Definitely. That wasn't Trodons at all. Now that I think about it. Um Tro oh my god. Trodons, they were intelligent dinosaurs. Um, but they weren't like Besides being intelligent, there wasn't anything like, um, like magnificent about them. They had the, like, largest, like, brain size. They were pretty much an animal with the largest, like, brain size to body. Uh, I don't see anything. Maybe it's clear. Leave the door alone. We're not going back out that way. Why not? Because we aren't backtracking, and those damn creatures could still be out there. Pretty much, Trodons, all they were, were they were just, they had the biggest body, uh, they had the biggest brain mass to body, um, size. And that was, like, it about them, really. That was, like, spectacular. Jerry, we should get moving. Yeah, are you ready? Yeah, let's go. This is not the time for grieving. We have to move. 
Maybe we should. She's right. It's a grenade. Billy, did you find something? No, nothing. Is everyone ready? What about decaf? I took care of that. It looked like you took something off him. And if he has something that will help us... I didn't find anything. I took his dog tags. Insurance doesn't pay out to his family unless his dog tags are returned. Satisfied? Right. Sorry for pushing. Should we bring him with us? Why bother? He's already buried. Look, I know where his body is. We're not equipped to transport it. Hopefully, we can retrieve his remains when this is all over. All right, listen up. Everything that just happened, bygones, understand? Doc, tell me again about the phones. Um, according to the terminal in my lab, the marine exhibit phones are still connected to the transceiver. The visitor center phones Too are- Too far away, okay? And we can get to the exhibit through the tunnels? They're all interconnected. I think I can still find- The answer is yes. Thank you. All right, we all have the same priorities here now. We get to this marine exhibit and find the phone. We get another chopper in the air to lift us out from there. How are we gonna get there? Trodon could still be out there. We aren't equipped to treat any more bites. We have to- Shh. I will not be shushed. The door. Oh no. Oh, I saw a quick time event. They're coming through the vent. That's not going to stop them. Come on. You should have moved the locker in front of the door, not like that, like the other way, like stand it in front. They're going past the door. They're in the vents. Uh. Whew, that was close. Jerry, get that grate open! Grab the... Need something to break the lock. Grab the fire hydrant. Something. The air tank! What? Use the air tank! It's heavy and sturdy! There it is. Oh, God. There we go. Oh, Billy! I can't hold the bug! Help me! I'm a little busy here. It's up there! What about him? Oh, throw me one! Oh, mouse. Uh, there we go. Okay, grab one and throw it. Toss it. Oh, Hands like off. a boss. Okay, now we gotta catch. Oh, we missed. Oh, uh, now we're dead. There we go, okay. Heads up. Grab it. Okay, down, down. Okay. Oh. There we go. Okay, break it. There you go. Good job, Jerry. You ain't useless. I got it. Let's go. <laughs> the thing's got a really long neck.
Come on now. Grab the flare. <laughs> Why did you dive? Oh, here comes the predator. Oh no. Which way, Laura? I don't know where we are anymore. We we need to head towards the north. Okay, what does that, that one say? Inland. That's the wrong way. Okay, then go this way. Keep moving. Go look back, it only slows you down. Uh, this way. Wait, the conduit's gone. Don't stop. Wait, those are water mains. No, follow them. Which way, Laura? Uh, I don't know, Jerry. We must be 40 feet underground. I have no idea where we are. Well, we can't just sit around with our thumbs up our butts. I, I don't hear them anymore. Their behavior seemed territorial. Maybe we're far enough away from the nest that they gave up on us. We might have outpaced them, but we're not exactly in a secure location. Which way are we heading, Doc? Um, look over here. Can you read these? Maybe. If I can find... Yes, yes, okay. We're at a four-way intersection. There are only four such intersections on the plan. Let me just cross-reference these detail labels. Okay. We just have to figure out which intersection we're at. Look around the corridors for any distinguishing features. I'll see if I can eliminate possibilities. Maybe I can help with the plans. They look pretty simple. Okay. So each place has a T, each place has one of those. I'm trying to look. What's the difference? I, oh, I, I can't tell that one. Look at me. I don't have enough to go on here. I need details, landmarks, something unique. They all look the same. Okay. Let's let's see about this one. This one's got like things written right here and like something right here. So let's Okay, these symbols are access ladders. These thick lines represent large pipes. The circles are water tanks. And these boxes with the crosses in them are power relays or transformers. Does that help any? Not on its own. But I can tell that the different intersections seem to have some small inconsistencies in layout. Like what? Like... Okay, so this one... Does it have a power... Okay, so we gotta look up. And if this one has a power box right here, so... We look up. Does Nima look up? The tunnel goes straight and then turns to the right. There are these two big electrical boxes of some kind on the right. Okay, so that... So the tunnel goes straight and to the right and there are two boxes, so that's a I'm no. I'm just gonna cross this one off. Okay, I hope you're right. Okay, so next we need to look at something like this. If it has water tanks, then it's a yes. If it doesn't, then it's a no. Okay, so we'll go to Jerry. There's a ladder on the right and on the far wall at the end. So it doesn't look like there are any water tanks. So let's go back here. 
and we couldn't see any water tanks right there, so that's going to be a no. Chess. Probably not this one. Yeah, I don't think so. So the only difference is between these two is how close the water tanks are. Okay. It seems the water tanks are pretty close to us on this one. So that means that we are on this one. So we can go here. We could be here. I guess they all kind of look the same. So let's cross that one off. I don't think it's this one. How can you keep them all straight? Okay, everyone, I think I've got it. Are you sure? Yes. I'm positive. We must be here. It's the only one that completely matches our surroundings. Okay, here we are. The desalination plant is here. We're not that far. No, we follow this route here. We follow any water mains at junctions in the direction of convergence. Even still, there's barely any turns. Look, just memorize this route. Here come the Trodons. What is it? Oh, shit. Just gotta keep him at bay. Fuck off. Fuck off. Wait, mate. Fuck off. I swear on my mom. Uh, down. Push the boxes. Good job. Didn't really do much. Get up. Oh, down, 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 down. It's down. I was pushing up because, I mean, up the ladder. Can't climb ladders. See? They can't climb up the ladder. Ladder climbing simulator, 2017. Hmm. Oh god, Jess! Oh, what have I done? Come on, Jerry. I just left her down there! I have to go find her! What? Back down there? With those monsters? No, Jerry. She needs you safe. Jess is a strong and resourceful girl. She's doing like we are doing. Surviving. You can't know that. I won't leave her to those animals. Jerry, look at me. If we go back down there, we won't make it to the bottom of that ladder. The others escaped down the tunnel we were going to follow. We know where they're going. The marine exhibit. That's where Laura would take her. And Yoder is with them. Oh, God. If we're going to join them again, that is where we have to go. The quickest way we can. You're right. Okay. We should be able to make better time over land. Can you get us there? No. North. Uh, it must be to the north, near the outlet of the river. Big river? With many falls? Yeah, the big river. Okay, good. That's something. Let me get my bearings, and we'll figure out how to get there. Por el amor de Dios. Do you know where we are? Let me think. It's been so long. This is my first time back on the island in nearly 12 years. Engine has changed it so much. Well, I'd love to dig into her backstory about how she used to live on the island, but that's our time. So we're going to end the episode here. Thank you again for joining me. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and check out our other videos, and we'll see you all again next time. Bye.